Well, folks, what's the crack? Hi, as all. Um, haven't done one of these uh, wee videos in a while, so uh, just a bit of a, a recap towards all things uh, podcast and Rebel Sundays and stuff. Um, so, yeah, we're back on, on live this Sunday with Rebel Sundays from 1 o'clock to 4 o'clock. Um, live, monthly streaming on Facebook, YouTube and Twitter. Uh, this week's special guest is um, coming all the way from Santa Ponza, uh, Mr. Santa Ponza himself, uh, Marty Higgins, good friend of the show, good friend of mine, so it's always good to have Marty on the show, so we'll be playing a few of Marty's songs uh, from his two albums he has released, and uh, we'll just be catching up with Marty as well, uh, just how he's been doing uh, post-Covid, how the Dubliners doing and what he's been getting up to uh, over the last uh, year or so, since we last had him on the show. Uh, so yeah, that'll be this Sunday, folks, from 1 to 4. Also, massive, massive uh, announcement on the show this Sunday uh, regarding for all fans of the hills of Donegal, uh, Saturday Supporters Festival. Um, up until Sunday, my lips are sealed. So, can't say nothing yet, but uh, this is massive, folks. Really big. Uh, a is won't be expecting this. Uh, news is coming out. Um, but I'm absolutely buzzing. I'm buzzing to be part of it. So tears again the Mickey and the family for asking me to be part of this uh, great festival. So all will be revealed uh, this Sunday, folks. So tune in between 1 and 4 and you'll hear the big news uh, regarding this year's Hills Donegal Celtic Supporters Festival. Um, what else? Yeah, so just again, thanks to everybody uh, last weekend from... Uh, sorry, not last weekend, the weekend before. Uh, for the Easter weekend, the Rock Bar. Three absolutely brilliant gigs. Uh... Saturday afternoon, I done before after the Celtic Rangers game. Brilliant buzz in the place, atmosphere was class. Then Easter Sunday, I played uh, after Clover uh, for a couple of hours. And then on uh, Easter Monday, upstairs as well, uh, it was on after Emer in the band. Uh, so three brilliant gigs. So cheers to Paul and the management of the Rock for having me uh, um, for having me down again for, for your events. Much, much appreciated. Um, so regarding the, the, the Celtic Rangers games, um, from next week onwards, obviously Celtic plays Rangers uh, in the semi-final of the Scottish Cup at Hampton. I'm going to be playing before and after the, the match uh, down at Nancy Mulligan's in Castle Street. So, uh, pleased to say now that um, the lads have asked me to do all, all, now all future uh, Celtic Rangers games in Nancy Mulligan's. So, actually, you'll, you'll, you'll find me, folks, uh, playing before and after uh, all uh, upcoming Celtic Rangers games down Nancy Mulligan's. Um, as you've seen my last one, obviously I play a bit of music uh, for all the gold celebrations and in between the, the game and obviously at half time and stuff. The, the buzz down there for these games is just, it's nothing like I've seen. Brilliant, brilliant bar. So i uh, really pleased to be getting part of the, the, the crew down there now, doing all their games. Looking forward to that there. Another big thing as well, we'll, we'll announce um, a few weeks ago now, this year's uh, Rebs for Hope, sorry, not Rebs for Hope, <laughs> um, the uh, Big Fans Gathering. Um, yeah, so this is the, the Big Fans Gathering 3. It's crazy to think that uh, this is the third year we're doing this year, uh, night. Um, mad to think, or like obviously three well, three years ago then, with, with well, the Herbrand idea on one of the live shows on a Sunday, that we'll, we'll get a gig going, get all the, the people who watch the show together for a night out, meet each other, obviously in person rather than on a busy behind a phone or a keyboard you know um so this will be the third one this year's one so it's taking place on uh saturday the second of december yes and we will have the the live podcast the next day as well the after party as we always do so um that there is to look for but the, the main uh big fans gathering three uh is taking place so on saturday the second of december this year at the the sarsfields uh gac club um in west belfast so cheers the the staff from uh sarsfields the committee for uh giving us their hall for this night hopefully this will be our main venue going forward for the gig because uh, i know this the third year in a row we'll have a different venue but uh obviously things happen folks and uh you try and get the right, the right venue for these. Uh, sometimes people don't really want to uh, be associated with Irish rebel music. Um, especially in West Belfast, it's pretty sad to see. Um, but yeah, so cheers to uh, Sarsfields for taking on this gig and giving us the venue. So it's, I think for me, it's probably our biggest one yet, folks. So tickets are now on sale uh, for the gig. They're £15 each. They're on sale at my uh, merchandise website. So it's www. Um, rebel rebel podcast that big cartel dot com. Um, if you go onto the Facebook page, you'll see it's all over it. Um, 
you can see the, the link for the tickets. So on the night, um, you'll have myself, uh, Rebel Row, um, I've been doing a bit of DJing, open up, uh, up, up first, we'll have probably one of the, the stars of lockdown, um, uh, Kev O'Driscoll, uh, we had Kev on the, sh the live show a few weeks ago, uh, so yeah, Kev is buzzing for this here gig, so we're really looking forward to having uh, Kev come up from Dublin um, for the gig on the night, so he's going to be opening up for us. Then uh, next up on stage is, uh, for me, probably the the most in-demand, and don't say it there lately, the most in-demand uh, rebel slash satellite, satellite singer on this whole scene at the minute, of course talking about uh, Shay Doolan from uh, Liverpool, who of course is... Um, Scouse, Irish and Proud, so he is. So Shay is going to be uh, bringing his show, his uh, unique sort of uh, version of all the Celtic songs and Rebel songs to our stage on Saturday the 2nd of December. And then the main act of the night is going to be for the third year in a row, uh, my good friends um, from Clover and County Limerick. Um, I sort of made the decision that we're going to, we're going to give these guys this... Uh, gig every year I give them their debut in West Belfast because they've been busting their balls for a lot of years trying to get a gig in West Belfast and they've done the first one for me and uh, they're back again for a third year in a row folks so really looking forward to having Clover back up in West Belfast so yeah folks will be back on the show back live this Sunday from uh, 1 o'clock to 4 o'clock with Rebel Sundays special guest at uh, Marty Higgins uh, loads of Rebel 203 hours plus um, tune in if you want to hear the big, big announcement. And I say big, big. This is massive, folks. The big, big announcement um, for uh, the official lineup, uh, dates, and location for this year's Hills Donegal Celtic Sports Festival. It's huge, and I mean huge. So uh, I really can't wait to tell you all about it. So uh, see you on Sunday, folks. Uh, I just get finished work early, which is great, and that's brilliant sunny day. So. Uh, Oh, what's going to happen now? I'll probably go home and hang some wise notes. So, well, <laughs> no, my luck. So, uh, see you on Sunday, folks, at 1 o'clock. Myself, Ro. Cheers. <laughs>